so as you can see this is oh my god i, I can't see it but okay okay it's here <laughs> let's just get into this video hi welcome back to my youtube channel my name is fumi and if you're new here welcome it's nice to meet you and um, hopefully by the end of this video you become a subscriber as well so today drum roll please today we are unboxing this sewing machine the domestic sewing machine is the name of the brand is um, butterfly i think you saw me on the front i can't see them. yeah I wanted this for such a long time and like I was finally able to get it I will let you know the price at which I purchased this in the, in the process of this video so basically like I just thought to share this experience of unboxing my dream sewing machine with you and I hope you enjoyed this video so let's get right into it all right so it came this is exactly how it came in this box and it's not so heavy like the fact that I can lift this while sitting down like it's not really heavy and then this is a tabletop sewing machine so like you, are, you need a table to actually set it up and everything so we open the box and the first thing that is here is this which is um honestly let me just let me confess now truth is i have already unboxed this white box door back so that i can share this with you guys like i had to open the box because i bought it at the market and i didn't want to be scammed i didn't want to come back home and realize that they gave me that eating inside the box is not the thing that they drew on the carton or come home and realize that oh there are some pieces that are missing like i don't know you know how these things are so like i actually yeah so this is a cover for the machine you know so like if you're not using it for a while or if you just want to cover it for the night or whatever there's this and then there is the manual half of it is in english and the other half is in i guess chinese or korean i'm not so sure please don't me. right so now we have this the machine is actually like encased in this styrofoam thing. okay so this is what we have and right here we have our electric pedal so i'm just going to put that aside for now and show you and show you all gathered here today. Here she is. <laughs> My baby. <laughs> Alright. Yeah. So this is she. My new sewing machine. My new butterfly sewing machine. And she is beautiful. Okay. And I already tried it. Just to make sure it was working because you know. Well, I've taken out the pedal and then I think I'm just going to like untie the cable. This is the part that goes into this side of the machine right here. And this is the part that you connect to a source of electricity. And then this is the pedal. You just place this on the floor. And I'm just going to put this. It was a piece of fabric that was kept right under the, the foot of the machine. And like it has some of the samples of the stitches, the different stitch variations that this machine can do. So I'm just going to put that back. And let's test run this pedal, shall we? Okay, so I've plugged it into the electricity and on the side, you right where you plug it in, there's a switch, so you just turn that on and then the light comes on. It works. Not like I didn't already know that, but like, it works. Alright, so for a closer look, this is what she looks like up close and personal these right here 
are the different stitch variations that you can go with is the regular straight and different straights and zigzags and all of that buttonholes as well this machine can do your buttonholes this is what i was talking about this um this right here like some samples of the different stitches here's the buttonhole zigzag smaller zigzag straight stitch and all of that came you know just to show like what this machine can do and then this is where like this is where you backstitch from so when you're sewing and you want to backstitch this you just hold this down and it backstitches this is the stitch that we're going on right now so from this knob right here if you turn it as you can see as you're turning it you're changing the, the stitches that you're going for so can you see that like we have all these stitches up here we have them here and all you need to do is turn this knob to decide what you want to do and then yeah and then this other knob right here is for the needle so if you need to lift the needle up a bit or something you just you know move it and then that works this is where we plugged it in and this is the power switch right here so when you turn that off the light goes off and when you turn it on the light comes back on so you open up this area you just slide this part out and you see some of the pieces that came with this machine okay so i'm just going to show you all the things that came with this machine okay so i haven't explored everything yet but these are obviously the bobbins machine needle these are different foot this one um this other one this one is for button holes and the brush you use this to clean some areas and all of that and connected to it here at the top is your um what's it called again oh my gosh your seam ripper yeah your seam ripper so that just goes right into your brush and i think it's really cute have this little bottle of oil machine oil and um a few other things as well i haven't used everything as i said so i'm still trying to figure out what each thing is but everything is properly stated in the manual how to fix them in how to use them and all that i'm just showing you because in case you're thinking of getting this machine or like you know you're wondering what machine to get now to open your your this area here to change the bobbin thread from here you just pull it open and then there you have it that's your bobbin case and you just take it out and you can change your bob it came with some thread already in the in the case so i'm just going to put that back so you just close this back up gently up here you also have this dial that you can like change the length of your stitches so when it came it was just on five this is where it was and their instructions basically the manual is really clear like how to thread it how to roll your um, bobbin thread and all that for a behind the scenes look this is what it looks like from the back and yeah there's nothing here because the other side is the, is the actual front where you get to see everything this is where you raise your your foot from so you just put that down and then the foot is down you want to raise it up that's where you raise it up from handle is right here and yeah so i can't wait to use this machine in future projects i'll show you what this machine can really do i'm really excited and yeah i think i'm just going to say my favorite thing about the machine is the fact that i can do button holes now like i really can <laughs> Okay, so let's try a, a different stitch. Let's try one of the zigzag stitches. I'll show you what, what it looks like. This is cute. <laughs> 
these are the two stitches that I ended up going with and that this is the straight stitch and this is the smaller zigzag stitch and yes really nice clean <laughs> it's a sewing machine yeah but like I think it came out okay and definitely I will update you as I try out other things thank you so much for watching this video to this point i am so grateful it's such a hot day and like i'm really sweaty but thank you so much and please support my small channel by subscribing liking you can even share i will be grateful so like i love to hear your feedback in the comment section so please hit me up in the comment section and i will definitely answer your comments your questions everything until next week <laughs> definitely until next week yes we are definitely going to have a tutorial of some kind we're going to handle this next week content this type of content is definitely important for like making decisions and i know that before i got this machine i had my doubts and i had my worries and everything and i really wanted to speak to somebody who had this machine and who had experience with this machine so that i could get like genuine feedback because me i don't used to trust all those um these things they used to write online like all those product reviews because i'm like <laughs> What if the sellers <laughs> or their friends or something like are the ones writing these things? So like that, for somebody that is very skeptical, like I would like to hear from somebody who actually has bought this machine and used it. So like from this small sample that I've done on this fabric, these small stitches, um, so far I really like what I'm seeing, and I'll let you know as things progress. Real reason we are all. Oh my God, it's so hot. <sighs> it is so hot. I can't. I can't even. But why isn't it working? Why isn't it? It's not moving. Okay. Maybe we should try. Oh, oh my God! I didn't. I didn't put my thread. Oh God! I didn't put my thread. Um. talk to me anyhow i have my machine definitely i have to go and open the gates <laughs> thank you